Have you ever imagined what it would be like to live on another planet? A planet that was similar to Earth, but bigger, more distant and perhaps more mysterious? A planet that could harbor life forms different from those we know, or even intelligent beings like us. Well, know that this planet could exist, and that NASA has just discovered a very promising candidate. It is the new super-Earth that is causing talk in the world of astronomy and science. In this video, I will tell you everything you need to know about this incredible discovery and why it could change our view of the universe and ourselves. Let's go! The new super-Earth was named Toy 715b and was found by NASA's Transiting Exoplanet Survey Satellite, TESS. TESS is a space mission that aims to search for planets that orbit other stars, called exoplanets. TESS uses a technique called transit, which consists of measuring the decrease in brightness of a star when a planet passes in front of it. TESS can determine the size, shape and orbit of the planet, in addition to estimating its temperature and composition. Toy 715b is one of more than 4,000 exoplanets discovered to date, but it stands out for some special characteristics. First, it is a super-Earth, that is, a planet with a mass greater than that of Earth, but less than that of gas giants, such as Jupiter and Saturn. Scientists believe that super-Earths are the most common planets in our galaxy, but they are still little known, as they are difficult to detect and study. Toy 715b has about 1.5 times the radius of Earth, and about 3 times its mass. This means, it can have a solid surface, like ours, or be an oceanic planet, covered in water. Second, it orbits a red dwarf star, which is a type of star, that is less hot and smaller than our Sun. Red dwarf stars, are the most abundant in the universe, and many of them, have planets around them. However, not all of these planets are habitable, as they are often too close, or too far from their star, receiving too much heat or too cold. Additionally, red dwarf stars, can be very unstable, emitting strong bursts of radiation, that can damage planets' atmospheres and life. Third, and most importantly, it is in the so-called habitable zone of its star, which is the ideal distance for a planet to have liquid water on its surface. Liquid water is considered one of the essential requirements for life, as it is the universal solvent that allows chemical and biological reactions. The habitable zone depends on several factors, such as the size, temperature, and luminosity of the star, as well as the size, mass, and reflectivity of the planet. Toy 715b is in the conservative habitable zone, which is the innermost part of the habitable zone, where the chances of having liquid water are greatest. These characteristics make Toy 715b one of the most interesting exoplanets ever discovered, and a strong candidate for being habitable, that is, for having favorable conditions for the existence of life. But this does not mean that he has life, or that this life is similar to ours. To know this, it is necessary to investigate its atmosphere in more depth, which is the layer of gases that surrounds the planet, and which can influence its temperature, pressure, and chemistry. The atmosphere may contain gases that indicate the presence of life, such as oxygen, methane and carbon dioxide, or gases that prevent life, such as hydrogen, helium and ammonia. To analyze the atmosphere of Toy 715b, scientists need to use another instrument, which is the James Webb Space Telescope, which will be launched by NASA in October this year. The James Webb is the successor to the famous Hubble Space Telescope, and will be the largest and most powerful telescope ever built. It will be able to observe the spectrum of infrared light, which is the band of light that reveals the composition of gases in exoplanet atmospheres. James Webb will be able to confirm whether Toy 715b has an atmosphere, and whether it has signs of life. The discovery of Toy 715b is a major advance for science, as it helps us better understand the diversity and complexity of the planets that exist in the universe. It also makes us think about our own origin, evolution and destiny, and about our place in the cosmos. Are we alone, or are there other life forms out there? Will we ever be able to visit or colonize these planets? Can they teach us something about ourselves? These are questions that still have no answer but that motivate us to continue exploring and learning. And you, what do you think of this discovery? Would you like to meet the new, Super Earth? Do you believe there is life on other planets? Leave your opinion in the comments, and share this video with your friends, who are also passionate about space. And if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and activate the bell to receive notifications of future videos. Stay tuned, and see you next time, 